Hello, Joseph Wagner here coming to you for our very first Bitcoin Minute on a Sunday out of beautiful Honolulu, Hawaii. It is 2.20 p.m. And let's dive right into it. Now, as anyone who follows my articles know that for the last couple of weeks, we have been expecting further price decline. And the reason being is fundamentally the failure of backed and its negative effect on Bitcoin futures due to the fact that Bitcoin at its core and Bitcoin holders and believers are against centralization and backed in essence was making Bitcoin a more centralized commodity. So maybe what we are seeing is a backlash to big business in Bitcoin. Nonetheless, the technical reasons, we've been expecting a death cross for quite some time now, at least a week or two, and we expect it to occur within the next week. Our article last Friday, we also expected a break below the 0.618, which sits at $7,973. Now this Sunday, a Monday in Australia, we got a break below that. Now... Where can Bitcoin pricing go from here? Well, I believe it's on a direct path to the 0.78 Fibonacci retracement level, which is pegged at 6,352. Now, where are we getting this retracement from? We're getting it from basically the point in which Bitcoin awoke from its slumber at 4,151 all the way up to 14,000. And the 0.618 is the most important number of all the Fibonacci numbers. In fact, all of the other numbers are made from this one number. So next week, or this week, as it already has started in Australia, we did in fact see a break below the 0.618. And I believe that it is going to get uglier. Why this is my belief is because not only will the death cross increase downside pressure, but also look at this Hankinashi chart. And if we look today, we have a first day that has an absence of an upper wick, as well as a much larger body size. And it's not due to low volume because as you can see, volume is it has been for the past couple weeks. So, I am expecting the downside pressure to increase and for Bitcoin to challenge the 0.78% retracement. I expect also the 200 day to provide maybe a short momentary pause, but not any real support. Well, that's it for now for the Bitcoin Minute. Thanks everyone who joined us for our very first very rough production. And we will get better bit by bit. Thank you. Goodbye.